Okay, people have fallen head over heels for biscuit love. This place serves up delicious food all made from scratch. I mean, what's not to love? Listen, it's delicious. We're so happy for your success. You and your wife Thank have such you. a business. Carl Worley is one of the owners. He's in our kitchen. It is National Biscuit Month. Who it knew? Is. So I'm so glad we that we're, wrap, we're wrapping this month up with yes. you. So we're so glad that you're here. You're going to share your family's biscuit recipe yes, with us. Yes, this Thank is you. it. This is the original. This is what started it all. Oh, my goodness. Okay, yeah. how do we get started? So, very easy. Um, I've got flour here. Okay. I've got everything measured out for you. You must obviously like white lily. Yeah. You so, brought this out. white me. lily is what we use in the restaurants, what we use at home. Uh, you need, for biscuits, you want a tender biscuit, and so you want something with low um, gluten content. White Lily, you can get it everywhere in the South. Um, it's one of our greatest exports. So. so when I lived in San Diego, my friend who is from here. Had to ship right. it to you. She was like, I can't make biscuits here. She goes, I don't have the white lily. Oh and she goes, they don't turn goodness. out the same. So it's good to yeah. have that sort of reinforcement. It's Definitely. true. Okay. So Great. I've already I've already shaved your butter here. The greatest thing about these biscuits. Shaved? Yes. Whoa. 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 Slow your roll. Hold on. I, I thought that was cheese. No. That's butter. I did so too. cold butter, always keep some in the freezer, and so I'll shave it um, just with either, uh, this is a microplane, uh, whatever you've got, yeah. shave it into your bowl. You will, you'll way. use a microplane like so this? So that way you can cut it in. You can cut it in easier. without, yes. Ooh. Let's make this easy. It's all about, yeah, it's all about being around the. What? Yeah. That's okay. brilliant. Genius. I've never thought of that. Okay. okay. So, so great. Flour. Yes. Do it. Flour. Do it. Go Do ahead. you want me to? Okay. Yeah. All right, you're okay. adding it in. Go ahead and dump it in. I didn't want to. I didn't want to make a gentle. mistake. Okay. You've got salt. <laughs> okay. You've got baking powder. Don't tell anybody, but there's a little sugar in there. A little. Yes. A little. Just Gotta a have some sugar. So mix that around. Okay. Oh, I like this. So you don't have to sift this flour at all. You don't have to That's sift nice. it. It's, what? If you want to get crazy and sift it, you can. Now, do I need a pastry cutter? I should no, use my you, hand. You should I? use your hand. Can I? Part of do you mind? Go in. No go cares, in, Carol. Right? Wait. Do you have a ring on? Wait. That's okay. <laughs> That's fine. You get okay. one biscuit, you get a real fun yeah, surprise. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> surprise. <laughs> it's like the king cake baby. It is. Yeah, <laughs> yeah totally. I've got Carol's ring. So once you've got your butter mixed in, you don't have to get it small. Okay. You just want really? It mixed in. Yeah. You're kind of blowing my mind here. I really love that. All right. So, yeah. we're going to go in with our buttermilk and our um, uh, heavy cream. Heavy cream and buttermilk. Heavy okay. Cream and Is buttermilk. there a specific kind or? Ooh, so Carol. look at look at I your buttermilk. Like I always that. tell people look at your buttermilk. If it has more than milk and cultures in it, put it back on the shelf. If it's got a whole bunch of other if things, it's you got can't. A hundred, yes, yeah. and you okay. can get it. Purity makes it here in town. Yeah. Um, look for a small dairy if you can. Hatch your uh, few different dairies. So you want to mix this until it just comes together, oh. and you can't see any of the um, flour hanging out. Okay, okay. so don't overmix. Don't overmix. Really? What are you doing at 4 a.m. in the morning? <laughs> right. Come you on. Know what? If, it means, if it means biscuits, <laughs> I'm kind of in. You started off as a food truck, and then you were like, we "Hey, did. let's do a brick and mortar, and let's do another That's brick perfect. and mortar, and another brick and mortar," and it's just taken off, and it's been gangbusters it's, been for you. It's been crazy. This yeah, is it's amazing. been a fun ride. We have some pictures, I believe, of some of the locations. What was the first brick and mortar? Was that? In the gulch? In the gulch, okay. yes. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Are those the bow nuts? Yeah. Those are bow nuts, oh, yeah. That's so yeah. good. This is delish. There it is. There you, is the they're the people. Beautiful. The people. The people. The people. Um, hey, and congrats on Za, which is Thank your you. pizza concept. Thank you. So good. So yeah. good. All right, so you've got that mixed together. Now so what do we do? So mixed together, and so right here what we've got is um, we're going to butter. You're buttering the, uh, the cast iron skillet. Okay. Always use cast iron. Yes. yes. Um, and so you want to take this and just dollop, dollop it into here a little bit at a time. Oh, hold so on. Whatever, what? whatever size you want your biscuit. <gasps> oh, look at you. Look at you. You're a professional. No. Now take, <laughs> this is the hard part. You ready? It. Okay. okay. Just do this a few times to knock off the extra. What? And boom. That's it? That's it. Look at you. This Put them is close so that they rise. They're going to they're gonna go somewhere, and so if yeah. they're close together, they're going to rise up. If they're far apart, then they're going to uh, spread out. I have of never, ever all the ever things thought. I've made, I've never made biscuits because I'm terrified I'm going to do Don't it Don't be wrong. terrified. That, that they'll be this bricks. This is the easiest recipe. Well, and this you is phenomenal. You can get this in the oven in, in 15 minutes. This um, is fun, though. So you're going to put it in the oven. What is your temperature? That put you... it in the oven. I like 400, 425. Okay. Because um, you want them to rise quick. Okay. Um, and then uh, just until they're brown and set and they're and cooked beautiful. through. Uh, come out. A little extra butter. Um, and then you can serve them with anything you would like. You uh, brought like jam. a compote over there. What is that I did. So this is my favorite thing. Yeah, um, that looks delicious. I this is... 
a little bit. Oh, we make, uh, for the bonus, we make uh, lemon curd. Yeah, you do. And then Here, let me get um, out of the way so on you top can of show lemon that. curd, I've put a little bit of the, um, our. Of heaven? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is sour cherry jam. Oh, oh stop what? with that. Are you kidding? That's amazing. Okay, let me ask you this. If yes. they're too. Carol, keep going. The, you're doing great. Crowding the pan. Is that a problem? No, you I feel like the I crowd. Cry. You do. Look, look you at how it came crowd. out. Yeah. Look at the final product over oh, here. Oh, I can. Do, I get room for more. Yeah. You got room for more. All right, I'm doing it. Um, oh, guys, don't you want to do this? Do you want to do this? This recipe is going to be on our website todayinnashville.com. I awesome. am so excited to try I... this at home. You made me a believer. Thank awesome. you so much for I sharing the love with us. Thank you, guys. This I can't eat enough of this. Here, here. Look at how sweet. This. I mean, seriously. That's what I'm saying.